We got some lashes, which I didn't even use. A bunch of things here. It doesn't look like there's a lot. Over two hours to film this video. I launched my own website. Honestly, I'm super impressed with myself and the fact that I did not throw this camera out the window. Let me just explain. It's taken me over two hours to film this video. Actually, way more than over two hours because I kept having problems. So first I wanted to like fix the autofocus and all of that and I think I kind of got it a bit down. I don't know, I can't tell. I wanted to fix the autofocus so I was watching videos and trying to figure it out. Then I started recording and then it said card full. I have three cards. So I empty I ended up empty I ended up uh, I ended up emptying two cards and I put them both in. I started filming five seconds into it, not working. And then I tried again, other card, not working. I've tried other cards, not working. Long story short, uh don't film in 4K if your SD card is not fancy. I put it down to not 4K. And look at us. I've been speaking for a minute and 45 seconds and I haven't started crying yet. You can see how long it's been taking me because... Look at my matcha. Anyway, hey! Welcome to a new vlog. It is actually Wednesday. Um, this vlog is going up tomorrow. But pretty much today I need your help. I left my room in mid-March and I'm back to my room now. It is mid-May. So Obviously, my things are all over the place. Things that are not mine are also here. Things that are mine are just everywhere. From the travels last month, I still have things that I don't know where they are. And yeah, I need to clean up my room and I need you to keep me entertained because if I don't vlog it, will I do it? No, honestly, I will. I will do it because it's driving me crazy. Yesterday, I moved back into the room and the first thing I did was I went and fixed like my makeup and my skincare and all of that. And then I was like, this needs to be a vlog. So welcome to your vlog. Um, come clean my room with me, please. Um, that's the name of the vlog. I need company. I need assistance. I need a friend. Okay. So I'm going to watch pretty basic or not watch. Listen and watch. And I'm going to clean my room. She's actually super clean. It's just things are everywhere it's messy but it's clean let me show you you want to see i'll show you hold on so we have a bunch of things here we have things there we have things there. i was working in that little area so i have my notes there we got that going on we got that that so much not my bed but she'll be here for a little bit look at that lovely not my things will be moved my days Look, there is so much going on. And then this is because my shelf fell a while ago. She's going to go back up. Oh, clothes. I have a lot of things to do. Then this is the bathroom. I'm charging. Got some lashes, which I didn't even use. Um, everything. Not mine. Not mine. But what's up? Things will be fixed today. I know that. It is the next day. Uh, yeah. I got super busy yesterday with work and stuff like that. And by the time I wanted to do it, there was no light outside. And I don't have ring lights and all of that. And it just didn't look cute, okay? I just wanted it to look nice. Um, but yeah, good morning. I woke up with a crazy stuffy nose. I have been waking up with a stuffy nose, actually, now that I think about it. For the past, like two months. I don't know what that's about. I'm not ill. It's just a stuffy nose. So I thought we should do the bed first because easy. Then I want to do that area because um, I'm working from home for the next few days and it's not getting like it's not it, you know. So let's do that. Um, let's finally play Pretty Basic. I've been saying this since yesterday. And, uh, yeah, I get to work, man. That, that over there is the part that I'm dreading. Because it doesn't look like there's a lot. But there's a lot, you know? Um, actually, I'm dreading all of it. Even this one. 
Okay, so let's do the bed first. And take it easy, step by step. We don't have to finish it all in one day. But knowing myself, I want to finish it all in one day. But no, that's, that's not the aim. The aim is to just clear out my space and make it livable, you know? The following podcast is a Dear Media production. And welcome back to Pretty Basic. I'm your co-host, Remy Cruz. And I am your co-host, Alicia Marie. That's okay. I mean, they're an amazing group, so we all get to a black name shirt, and we can wear them all the way to the Is that, like, weird? I don't like it. Okay. No, 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 I'm like, can I? Is that... I love it. Oh my god. Thank you. That was so tiring. <laughs> the next bit is that I think I don't know what these are, but I need to clear that up. So let's set you up somewhere. So next to my bed, I have these. I don't know what's uh okay. I was going to a like disco themed party and I asked Yasmin if she had anything silver and she did. But that's his means. I'll put that aside for her. Oh, this is my beach bag. These can go back in their place. Oh, it smells like sun. Actually, no, it doesn't. Uh, this is almost out. Hair protection spray and the other sunscreen, and then this can go back in its place. Then on my bedside, I think everything's fine. I'm gonna put this away. Let me explain. So I have these like really bad eye strains that I get throughout the day. So if I'm on the laptop for too much at some point, girl, I can't see. Everything's blurry, and like I can feel the inner corners of my eyes like really giving in. And so that's why I thought I needed glasses. Why so when I did an eye test years ago, he said I have astigmatism and whatever, whatever. He gave me these glasses. Then a few months ago, it started to feel weak again and it started to feel like really bad. But I wasn't getting migraines and stuff like I used to anymore. So I went to the eye doctor and he checked and he's like, girl, stop wearing your glasses. I was like, what do you mean? Pretty much he's like, if you wear your glasses, your eyes are going to get like reliant on it and you shouldn't wear glasses. He's like, only wear them if you genuinely feel like you really, really need them, like your eyes are like giving in. But besides that, do not use your glasses on a daily. So I haven't been using my glasses. I used it once, like last week or something, because I was working on the laptop for a really long time. But besides that, I'm trying to not, so I can like push my eyes to be strong. But just even talking about it, I can feel that thing in my inner corners. And it's like the most annoying thing in the world, I swear to God, if I go to a restaurant, and the lighting is really low, I can't see the menu. Like I can't read because it hurts my eyes to read and like everything's blurry. So kind of scary, honestly, but I don't know. I don't know what it is. That was my glasses. I got this cute little thing in Japan. It's like a cute little, it's a cute little notes thing because I wanted to put it on everyone's like little gifts, but I didn't get to and I'm gonna use them for something else. But I think this should go to my desk. Yes. I'll move it aside. Um, so this is done. Let's see inside. My reading lamp. Why do I still have cards from like my old jobs when I left and everyone's like, oh my god, bye, I miss you. This is kind of cute because all my girlfriends are here now. So I'll keep this. Only because of my girlfriends. This is like a bedroom spray to sleep. And then a pen. For what? I don't know. I think because I used to like journal next to my bed, which I should start doing again but anyway going to my desk this one Tanu got it for me for actually I don't know when she got this is ages ago she got this a long time ago because I was dealing with really really bad anxiety and panic attacks so she got me this it says find calm and I always keep it next to me oh was I trying to start this but then I started something else Oh no, I did start this. I have no recollection of this part. Oh, okay. I'm gonna continue this because it already started juicy. And then I'll do this later. I only did like, I didn't even start this on it. I just did like a page. This is gonna be the book. They're both Colleen Hoover. Tell me your basic without telling me your basic, you know. And then I have my journals, which... I mean, I'll keep them here. Oh my god, my journal. Rant. This is ranting. 
the earliest date here is um, 15th of January 2021 and then the last time I wrote was not too long ago actually January 3rd 2024 but yeah literally ranting then I have my journal my gratitude journal honestly don't get it it's cool it's pretty it's cute to like look back on and stuff but you, it's nothing that you can't do on your notes on your phone you know what I mean or like you can write it yourself I don't think you need to buy like a whole thing dedicated to it you know it's kind of I don't know I wouldn't get it again but I'm gonna put these back in here so whenever I feel like ranting I can just reach out and do it my reading light that's that let's put the book back here is the disaster this was from my birthday when was my birthday the end of march so don't need her anymore this is from akil's event it's a lollipop i'm gonna save it because i'm gonna have it soon uh these are for my glasses and my screens don't know where to put them i still have my food vouchers from when i did bread so that's trash i have my aloe yoga gift card yet to use it every single time I want to use it. I mean, they're not going to Dubai Mall or I'm in Dubai Mall and I forgot to take it with me. So I'm going to put this in my bag. Don't know where it is. Medicine from last week. It can go back to the medicine cabinet. This one, I was using it for my camera. Uh, my jewelry box. She needs organizing. Let's do that now. It's been put in place because of what I want to have. Now I'm finally used to saying it, but um, yeah, if it worked for like... So this is going to go in there. So I'm going to keep it there. Every, everything is going there. Um, my coasters can go down here. Oh my days. <sighs> I have these four. They're full. I don't know what's in them. I think... Actually, I don't know. Oh, I think this is my birthday. These three, I have no idea. And I need to go develop them. It'll be a cute surprise, so I'll put them in the front on top so I can see them. And then down here I have all my Asuline books, so I'm going to leave them there because they look perfect together. Then I have the Euphoria book and um, another book. So I don't know what to do with these. So my Euphoria book was actually on one of those shelves over there, but the shelf fell. So I'm going to wait till it's fixed and I'll put it back. This one... I think I'm going to put this in my, I have a stack of things packed away for one day, inshallah, when I buy my own house. Inshallah, mashallah, I love you. Um, I have a lot of things that I've already either bought or been gifted and I'm like, oh, I would love to use this in my future home. So um, I'm going to put this in that stack as well. And then inshallah, we, um, we get to unpack it together in my house one day. Inshallah, mashallah, I love you. I have this Gucci notebook that came in like a gift bag. It can go to my desk now, I guess. This is dead. I'm going to see if I'm able to get it fixed. If not, she has to go. Glasses. Go to the glasses area. I love this lighter. Oh, I love. Oh, it's so cool. I feel like a baddie when I use this. This godforsaken box of things. There's so many things in here that just, why are they here? So I'm going to go through this box, put things where they belong. Like I have shoelaces, a bracelet, and then I have my international license. Random things. So let's go through it and get this done. Yeah. Hopefully no one's clicked out because I have no idea what I'm doing at all. Yeah. So we got engaged in September and around December I was like, okay, if... I have so many um, birthday and PR letters in here. And I have like stickers and stuff that I bought in Japan that I want to decorate my laptop cover with, but I don't have a laptop cover yet. So this is for another time. But yeah, so many receipts. I even found my debit card in there. Not good, you know? What is this? Money. But what money? Okay. From when I was in Doha. How much is this in dumps? I don't know, but I'm keeping it. So the next part is my couch. This pink girl 
Um, it's my favorite thing in my room, I think. Is it? Yes, it is. I actually thrifted it. The fact that I wanted a pink couch and then this thrift store just managed to have a very simple pink couch was crazy to me. But, wow. There's things everywhere. So I'm gonna go through all of this, see what's happening. Because I have like PR things here. I bought a toothpaste yesterday and I just left it there. Usually I wouldn't. Listen, usually I wouldn't, but because I knew I was cleaning today and stuff like that, I didn't mind. But usually I just throw it in the trash. But yeah, I need to go through all of this. My bag's here, but then like I have another bag here. And I think, oh, there's another bag here. That's a big one. And I know there's another one somewhere, I think. But I need to figure out what bag is going to be my daily bag now because I feel bad for her. She's been going through it. This is not a daily bag. And yeah, I just need to figure that out so I can put things from the table into the bag and all of that. So let's get started with my couch. This is gonna be the bag. I think it's JWP. How do you say it? Is it? It is. It's JWP. So I'm gonna use this as my daily bag. She actually fits a really good amount of things in here. So let's do that. Let's transfer and then pack those so they can go in my bag drawer. I mean, I don't know either, and so it just kind of depends, but uh, right now we haven't found the place yet, we're still looking, but it talked about OJ with Accelerator, yeah, and for another like month, but it's just crazy that um, died like prematurely and you didn't get to fulfill your like goal, you're given like another chance. So this is the final look at this area, cute, clean, love that for me. So it did take me some time to get this done because I was working at the same time and then I made myself a matcha and then I was sitting and working, I was being focused and trying to be disciplined. Yeah, so I finished this area, I'm very happy with what it looks like, I still definitely need to go through the drawers of everything like the tv console my desk and all of that but i think i'm gonna do that in another vlog i definitely don't have the attention span for that right now and i have a lot of work to do actually um so i'm gonna continue working and that area i also think i'll leave it for another vlog i am tired i'm not tired i'm just like you know out of breath in that so this is a half of my room um organization and then in the next vlog probably i'll do that side and then i need to do my desk i need to do my tv console i need to do my closet and i need to do my bathroom there's so much more left to be done but i will get it done so thanks for watching oh wait before you go Brittany. before you go but i launched my own website back in like 2017 I think it was 2017, I launched an online magazine, a digital magazine. It was very just me sitting and doing the work, not knowing anything about the industry, not knowing anything about publications or anything like that. It was me doing it out of like a passion project. And then obviously I had my three years of experience at Hypebeast. I had my experience as like my own Instagram and going to events and blah 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 and then i also i just worked more experienced life more and was more um, exposed to the industry and last week i decided very impulsively that i want to relaunch it it brought me a lot of joy and i really do love creating content and writing and all of that so i brought her back to life so this is the website the magazine is called cake it's inspired by the fact that a lot of people call me cami cakes and i came up with this name ages ago i kind of wanted to like rebrand it i wanted to rename it but i don't know cake just feels special to me and i just really like the way it sounds and all of that and then i realized i didn't realize this when i first launched in 2017 but i realized that there's a magazine i think it's european or something called cake so i was like oh no what am i gonna do now and i don't know i don't know how these things work but i don't want to get in trouble for it one day like i'm definitely not trying to like overstep or whatever so i decided to call it cake the mag it is still referred to as cake but it's cake the mag to avoid issues 
And also I just really like how that sounds. It's longer, it's cuter. So I have Instagram for it. I started the TikTok, the website and all of that. And right now it is super solo, but I will eventually want to get like interns and freelancers and things like that um, to help with creating content. So my brain is a little all over the place because I have my full-time job, which is around content. And then I have my own Instagram and TikTok and YouTube content. And then now I have Cake as well, which is all also content. So just trying to find that balance and understanding what my priority is. Obviously, the priority is my full-time job. And then I would say Cake and myself are at the same level because I do see the future looking bright for Cake and for myself. And um, I am putting like 100% of my effort into it. But you just have to keep in mind that when you work a full-time job, you have to respect your employers and you have to just making sure that like I don't screw up that opportunity. And also like my full-time job is like a dream. So um, I'm trying to make sure that I'm staying balanced and um, figuring out my schedule for this. So I think what I want to do as well is like get a whiteboard or something like that and put it on my wall either here or in the bathroom and kind of put down a schedule of like, today I'm dedicating two hours to this, I'm dedicating five hours to this, and obviously full-time job on the weekdays and all of that. So I'll figure that out, but I'm super grateful that I do get to do these things, you know? But that's it, that's pretty much an update on my life slash career slash um, schedule. But thank you so much for watching, I'll see you next Thursday for further cleaning and all of that. Bye!